Hello and welcome to Andre's YouTube vlog for August 20th, 2011. Well, as I speak, none other than Mr. Robert Zimmerman, known to many of you as Bob Dylan, is going to be performing tonight at the Bangor Waterfront with special guest Leon Russell. Now, as many of you, um, you know, Bob Dylan fans know, uh, Leon Russell was also on tour with him and George Harrison and Ravi Shankar in 1971 for the famous uh, concert of Bangladesh. I was going to actually go to the concert tonight uh, to see these two because I am a great admirer of both of these people. And uh, it's interesting to note that I'm not the only person in my family who had an experience with uh, Bob Dylan live, so I don't feel so bad either. On uh, November 27th, 1975, um, a little less than 36 years ago, my father attended a concert uh, of Bob Dylan's Rolling Thunder Review in the Bangor Auditorium. And he had his kids, you know, Jacob, now remember the Wallflowers were all running around in the back, and you know, he had that big long hat and this kind of white circus clown trickster makeup all over his face. And he was performing songs like uh, Hurricane, Tangled Up in Blue, that were out from that period. He had records like Blood on the Tracks out and Desire, which are great Bob Dylan albums. And he had people such as uh, Joan Baez, uh, Ramblin' Jack Elliott. I don't know if he was up here on the tour. He might have been. And Joni Mitchell. Now, one funny story my father mentioned is that, you know, Bob was great, in great spirit. Scarlett Rivera was playing that great, you know, gypsy violin of hers, and, you know, uh, um, Mick Ronson on guitar got really into it. Uh, Joni Mitchell, on the other hand, she had an album out called Hygiera at that time. She came out, didn't do much, and was kind of aloof with the audience, and he was surprised at how negative he thought her attitude was, but you know, knowing what I know now about Joni Mitchell, I sort of understand. You know, the singer-songwriter movement in the 70s was about a lot of people who were kind of, you know, both at the same time rejecting and embracing celebrity, so there was a lot going on with that. But why didn't I go to the Bob Dylan concert today in Bangor? It's very simple. Honestly, it's nothing personal against either Leon or Bob Dylan, who I still greatly admire, still get their new albums when it comes out. And, you know, if there's a live album of this, believe me, I'll, I'll have it, honestly. But there are two factors. If this had happened 36 years ago, if they had come up here as maybe part of, the, part of the Rolling Thunder review, I would have been there, you know, with my dad. I mean, it would have been, that would have been what had happened. But, honestly, Bob Dylan's voice even though a lot of people have questioned it, just isn't quite what it used to be. I mean, even for Bob Dylan, it isn't quite what it used to be. And Leon Russell, you know, I, I don't know if he has the songwriting and compositional power that he used to. And these people, I don't know if they have the power to influence a generation. One thing I do know about the um, Bob Dylan concert that's going to be taking place today is that very much in the spirit of, of Dylan and activism and all of this, um, Equality Maine, the organization that um, sponsors um, same-sex marriage in the state of Maine, is going to be having a booth um, somewhere at or near the Dylan concert. And, you know, because Bob Dylan in his prime with songs like, you know, Times They Are a Change and, and My Back Pages and so on and so forth, and, um, you know, Masters of War, Blowing in the Wind, you know, he was considered to be an important figure of the 1960s uh, um, peace movement, political protest, you know, unconventional attitudes, somewhat of a founding father of the counterculture, and somewhat of a, you know, that's part of history now. But... I'm very glad that Equality Maine have made an arrangement to be there. I think it's very much in the spirit of what Bob Dylan represents and his activism, and uh, I really appreciate this is happening here in Bangor. It's kind of like uh, uh, 1971, you know, 
in 2011, you know, just that same general atmosphere. And, um, you know, if you are going to the Dylan concert tonight, if you're in Bangor and watching this, you know, go to a quality main, talk to him. Hopefully you sign up. And, uh, you know, hear him out. Enjoy the Dylan show. And, um, you know, I'll, I'll be there in spirit. And I'm just making this video to, uh, you know, just send my props out to uh, Mr. Zimmerman and Mr. Russell out there. And uh, thanks for the music. Andre's YouTube vlog for August 20th, signing out.